Greetings, minions, survivalists, and fellow gamers. This is Slipblade playing Seven Days to Die. It's Alpha 18.3, and it's episode 61. Uh, 18.3 just came out. Like, I downloaded it this morning. And uh, there is some noted changes. Uh, I didn't go through all the change log, but I could definitely see that the font style for the uh, health and stamina, uh, that's been kind of cleaned up a little bit. Um, so it's a lo lot neater looking and easier to, uh, to read, especially for my goofy eyes. Uh, I haven't really checked into it much, but uh, yeah, the, the font's a little bit bigger, and that's kind of a good change, I guess. All right. Um, I don't know what else has been done besides all this, but um, I, I just knew that it was a language pack, so, you know, there's that. Alright, so I don't remember what I wanted to do, but I surmise, I really didn't change, the, change that much with the uh, glare from the snow and the uh, fog, but... Um, oh, well, they've added wind speed in there. Okay. Uh, so let's see. We need to think about what we're going to do here for, uh, hmm. Okay, so apparently over here is some nitrate. I think we can probably do some mining. Um, how much wood and stone do I have? That's uh, alright. So we'll, we'll just uh, go and get the nitrate, I guess. It's a uh, center on the map, and we'll let's see. So, the track the way back. There we go. There is some lead, some stone. Take that tree. <laughs> and now we're pushing it. <laughs> oh man. That's just funny. Alright. Did I kill her? Oh, no. Guess not. So I have to warn you guys. Uh. I am just beat. Someone's walking this way. I am absolutely beat. And the nephews are not making it any easier. There you are. beating around up here. So I'm a little bit exhausted and uh, it's 
probably not going to be good for the gameplay. I was tired last night when I recorded uh, Battletech, and I made some gross errors. Oh, not, not serious errors, but just stupid errors. Namely with just naming the episode, you know, the numbering of it and all that. It was a mess. Not a big, big deal, but it's a deal, you know? And I didn't bring a shovel. Crap. Somebody's out and about here. Where you is? Are you making the noise? Okay, it's it's gone now, so I guess not too big a deal. All right, let's uh. Try to widen the hole a little bit. Really should have brought a shovel, but just not in my uh, thinking game today. Now we need the nitrate and we need the uh, the coal. cook up some gunpowder and there was a node of nitrate here which according to the game uh, rules or whatever um, that means that there's a vein of that stuff underneath it which you could see right now pretty much at my feet That's stone, actually. And there's the nitrate. Okay, excellent. Now we'll also get some stone as a um, sight effect. I have no objections to that since uh, we can use that. So just keep going around in a little bit of a circle here, and then we'll use the um, um, wood frames to get up out of the hole. At least when the time comes for it, anyway. So I have to, I don't know, I feel compelled to apologize to, to you guys that, uh, you know, it might not be all that interesting. I, I guess we'll, we'll definitely have a, a horde night, and we'll see how that goes. I turned up the max number that would spawn on horde night all the way up to 64. Now... It might be a bit much, but we'll see how it goes. It'll definitely give the base a, a good run for the money.
Now one thing I also noticed is that you can actually have an airdrop every day if you wanted. Or that was not the case. Um, yeah, let's just keep mining. I hear something up, up top. If it drops in on my head, well, I got a gun. Okay, so you see the, you got, of course, the dirt layer, and then you have, like, little bits of gravel in here. And those always lead to veins of resource. So right there is, there's a little bit of sand from the gravel, and now we're back into a vein of nitrate. And you could follow these damn things all over the place in here. Oh, we got oh, we got iron in there. So we're getting a pretty good stack of. Uh, let's see what we got here. 966 nitrates. That's really good, actually. And if I recall correctly, I think there was a node of coal up near Echo Base. So one plus one equals kaboom. <laughs> That's what I'm hoping. Okay, we'll get this little patch right here and then we'll nerd pull our way out. Ground floor. All right. So we got ourselves got a little clay, which is good because you're gonna need clay in in whatever forge you got. Um, the stone, which we can convert into um, cement, and the nitrate powder, which is rockstar awesome. Um, let's see. We'll look we'll at the lead too. Now these are a bit more common. Actually, I want to put a marker. There, and then lead can get a marker as well. And we'll dig up this much. We'll just go like that for now. Um, hmm. Well, let's go inside and see if we can get if any. Oh, hello there. There we go. So this safe should have respawned. Now it's got some ammo. That that's kind of nice. Um, I'm not really concerned about the loot out of here, but I did want to check that. Uh, that safe. Ooh, that's a book. Whoop. That's a book I have not read. Yuka. Okay. 
so fridge is a bust. Another book. I wonder if, if um, huh? That must be something to do. Oh, dang it! I keep hitting that that one I key. Um, seems that uh, these are no longer tied to a crafting perk. Because I thought I was able to craft um, chili dogs and all that, that mess uh, without, I don't know. It might be just a subtle change from um, Alpha 18.2. Either way, it's something red and in my, my book. It's in my uh, wealth of knowledge. Why, hello! <laughs> I so love floaty heads. <laughs> got some time let's see about getting a uh, a note of coal we'll have to head back to beta base uh, hello bear <laughs> up to fetch the shovel and on top of that we also will need to um, Get the gunpowder rolling. So there's more lead right there. A lot more lead. Also need to get some repair kits to uh, repair the pickaxe. Right there. Um, we can deposit some of this stuff already. And that's emptying out. Let's see, I need to get some wood. Um, yeah, I'm jumping the gun here. We got some coal. Yeah, let's just leave that in there for right now. And there's that. That should be good. Let's get out there to the coal node. It's um God dang. Somewhere out in here. Okay, that's not what I wanted. 
There we are. I can't even see it. It's so bleached out. Just say it's like somewhere in there. Now we probably should be uh, crafting all this at the new base. But we'll get get the gunpowder made at the old one and um, worry about it later. right over here. Okay, we can take this. Just move it over a bit. So let's uh, get to digging. Surprised not seeing any gravel. That's just stone. That's weird. I'm pretty sure that this was a cold. Oh, here it is. Yeah, I was pretty sure there was a coal deposit here, but the rock and the stone kind of look pretty much like the same. And look at that experience. Good lord. Now, I, I want to get... Eh, I need to cool off a bit. I want to get at least uh, 1,500 coal. out. There's the gravel. So much easier than digging it with a pickaxe. Okay, this is stone right here. Hmm.
Oh. Somebody's up there. Wrong. <laughs> Hit the wrong buttons. Got him in the beard. All right, back to diggy diggy hole. Oh, got nitrate here too. Well, that's just peachy. But I'm kind of more interested in the uh, coal right now. This is kind of confusing to have like stone and coal, but you know, like one area will be nothing but stone, and another area will be coal, uh, stone and coal. I do like the fact that these deposits, especially since uh, there's nitrate and coal in this area, I like that those are near Echo Base. Let's get this all cleared off. Get picking. All right, so seven sixty. We got a ways to go yet. At least for the target mark, anyway. We're at a thousand. Eleven seventy four. Thirteen twelve, so we're almost there. And let's see. Fifteen and nineteen, so that should be enough for now. Right. Let's head back.
sec there, I didn't know where I was was going. And I think I'm, yeah, I am kind of off the beaten track here. Crap. <laughs> Blue. Now I know I'm off. Shit. Shouldn't have went cross country there. Alright, now we're back on track. Alright. And it's just before dark anyways. I mean, we got a couple hours left. Of, of daylight, but yeah. All right, we need to do that. Do that. All right. Yeah, we'll just leave that. that. And this will probably be one of the last times we use um, the chemistry lab here at Beta Base. Stack of gunpowder. Huh. Seems like this would be more worthwhile. Because, yeah, you can pack gunpowder tight. Uh, I don't know about this, because... A stack of a thousand gunpowder. It may be cheaper to make it this way. I mean, like 0.8 for each one unit of gunpowder. Let's uh, let's do it like this. We'll make us make a stack of this and see if it makes. It takes 800 to make a thousand. And then we'll do it the uh, the regular way. Where it's one and one to make one. So that's another 27 minutes. Eh, should be plenty. Alright, so you'll just pack the rest away up here. Uh, we gotta get that. And snowballs. I need to get some food in me. some tea anyway. Alright, well, uh, it's been a, a productive day. So, I'll end the recording here. Uh, we have gone over anyways. But, um, I think I'll overnight 
this and join you guys in the morning. Um, or I, I might do an, another. I might do an episode at night just because I'm not really afraid of what's out there and uh, just trying to gather the resources as quickly as I can. Um, I'm gonna have to consider moving some things over to alpha base so I don't know that depends on what I'm, I'm thinking is best in the next uh, few minutes after this is recorded so anyways thank you guys for watching I hope you enjoyed it and until next time see you later twitch twitch